Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can customize your dashboard inside of Go High Level. So you may have seen other people with totally custom dashboards, so they have different fonts or different background colors and so on, and you're thinking how you can do that yourself, or you have seen other people trying to sell you services telling you that they can customize your dashboard for you. Well, in this video, I'm going to show you how you could do this for completely free and how to do this without knowing anything about code. But before you get into it, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. And now let's get into it. All right, so the first thing you'll have to do is download a Chrome extension called Visual CSS Edit. Editor. This Chrome extension will allow you to edit the CSS of Go High Level and will allow you to basically do whatever you want to Go High Level's dashboard. So go ahead and click right here and download it. And once you do that, it'll look like this. And you can just pin it right here to make it easier to access. All right, so now that you guys have that downloaded, all you have to do is come back inside of Go High Level and then come over here and click on the Chrome extension. And right away, it's going to take you to the editor. So now you can start editing Go High Level's dashboard. And to do that, all you'd have to do is click on the area that you want to edit. So for this example, we can just click over here and change this whole entire background instead of just having the option of white or black that go high level has we can change this to whatever color that we want and to do that you'll just come over here to this box click on background and then right here where it says color you can choose whichever color that you want so for this example we could just make this like a gray color just like that also let's say that you don't like go high levels default font we can change the font as well by coming over here clicking on text and then where it says font family we can choose whichever font that we want and as you can see it's changing over there to the left so for this example let's just do this one right here and now we can continue editing this so let's say that you want to change the color of this bar again you just click on the area that you want to edit and then we can go to backgrounds change the color so we can do like a red now not only can you edit the dashboard of go high level but if you don't like what something looks like we can actually remove things of go high level as well so let's say that we wanted to remove this bar right here we would just come over here go to where it says extra display and then we could just remove this all together now let's say that you want to edit a section with your brand colors and you want to use the exact color not just a similar color there's another chrome extension that I use that's called color pick eyedropper and with this chrome extension all you have to do is select the color that you want so I'm just going to select my logo color click on it and then we can copy this number right here and then once you do that let's say that we wanted to edit this section right here we can just click on this section go to backgrounds and then for the color all we would have to do is paste in our color number right here that we copied and just like that our exact colors are going to pop up so now that you have your brand colors you can continue editing this so since this is purple we can change this to purple as well so go to background color paste in our number and just like that it's going to change so now since this text is hard to see we can click on it put a text and then we can change the color to white so i think you guys get the point by using this chrome extension you can easily change the dashboard to your liking so now that you guys have edited your dashboard to your liking it's going to be very easy to apply this all we have to do is come over here to where it says export and you're just going to want to copy this code right here so now that you guys have that copied you can exit out of here and go back to your agency view and then once you're in your agency view all you want to do is go to settings and then come to company and then right here where it says custom css all you want to do is paste in that code that you copied and then when you're done all you have to do is click on update company and then refresh and just like that you'll be able to see all those customizations that you made so guys this is a really cool thing that you guys can do with your business by customizing your go high level dashboard you're going to be able to differentiate yourself from other go high level businesses instead of just using go high levels default dashboard like most people are you can change things up a little bit separate yourself from other businesses and really make go high level look like your own so i hope you guys enjoyed this quick video if you guys are new to go high level and you want to learn how to set up your business be sure to check out the free course that i have in the description and now if you guys aren't subscribed please subscribe to the channel and i'll see you in the next one.